Hey there, it's essential to listen to what your body is telling you. Have you noticed increased thirst, unexplained weight changes, or lingering fatigue? These could be signs your blood sugar is too high. But fret not, in this video, we'll guide you through these alarms with clarity. Understanding these signs early is your key to taking control. Stick around as we share a proven method that not only informs, but empowers you in your pursuit of better health. Let's dive in together. Number one, increased thirst and frequent urination. One of the alarming signs of high blood sugar is an increase in thirst and frequent urination. When blood sugar levels are elevated, the body attempts to eliminate the excess glucose through urine. High sugar levels in the blood lead to increased filtration of glucose by the kidneys, resulting in more glucose being present in the urine. The kidneys, responsible for filtering waste from the blood, try to remove the excess sugar by excreting it in the urine. To do this, the body increases urine production, leading to more frequent trips to the bathroom. As the body loses more fluid through increased urination, dehydration occurs, triggering a sensation of increased thirst. The increased thirst is the body's way of signaling the need for more fluid intake to counteract the dehydration caused by frequent urination. By increasing fluid intake, the body aims to restore a balance in blood sugar levels and prevent further dehydration. In the context of diabetes, this mechanism becomes crucial. The inability to effectively utilize glucose leads to elevated blood sugar levels, triggering the body's attempt to eliminate the excess through increased urination. Recognizing increased thirst and frequent urination as warning signs allows you to be proactive in managing your diabetes. Understanding these signs prompts you to seek medical attention for proper diagnosis and management, potentially preventing long-term complications. If you've been enjoying this content and find it helpful, don't forget to show some love by smashing that like button. Your support fuels our passion to create more content like this. Let's proceed with more facts. Number two, fatigue and weakness. When there is an excess of sugar in the blood, the body's cells may struggle to use glucose efficiently for energy instead of relying on glucose. Cells may turn to alternative sources such as fat and muscle tissue for energy production. This process is known as glucose starvation, leading to a lack of sufficient energy for the body's cells. Insufficient energy from glucose affects the normal functioning of cells and tissues. Fatigue and weakness can be pervasive as the body struggles to meet its energy demands. The reliance on alternative energy sources may not provide the same efficiency as glucose, contributing to a sense of exhaustion. For people with diabetes, fatigue and weakness can be indicative of uncontrolled blood sugar levels. High and fluctuating blood sugar levels can contribute to long-term complications in diabetes, such as damage to blood vessels and nerves. Fatigue may result from a combination of factors, including poor energy utilization, dehydration, and disruptions in insulin regulation. Recognizing fatigue and weakness as signs of high blood sugar encourages people with diabetes to monitor and manage their condition more effectively. Early detection allows for prompt adjustments to medication, lifestyle, and dietary choices to maintain blood sugar within a healthy range. Understanding these signs empowers you to take proactive measures in consultation with healthcare providers. Number three, blurred vision. This is one of the alarming signs that your blood sugar levels may be too high, especially in the context of diabetes. This visual impairment occurs due to the impact of elevated glucose levels on the eyes. High levels of glucose in the blood can cause the lens of the eye to swell. The lens is responsible for focusing light onto the retina at the back of the eye. When it swells, it can disrupt the normal process of focusing, leading to blurred vision. The swelling of the lens affects its flexibility, making it difficult to change shape for proper focusing. This results in difficulty seeing objects clearly at various distances. Blurred vision can extend to difficulties seeing in low light conditions or at night. This is particularly problematic for people with diabetes, as it can impact their ability to navigate in the dark. 
Prolonged high blood sugar levels can cause damage to the blood vessels in the eyes. This damage may lead to a condition called diabetic retinopathy, characterized by damage to the retina and potential vision loss. High blood sugar levels can contribute to changes in the shape of the lens, leading to the development of cataracts. Cataracts can further contribute to blurred vision. People experiencing blurred vision are likely to seek medical attention promptly. This can lead to a timely diagnosis of diabetes or adjustments to the diabetes management plan. Managing blood sugar levels effectively, based on the recognition of blurred vision, can enhance the overall quality of life for people with diabetes. Number 4. Slow Healing of Cuts and Wounds this is one of the alarming signs that your blood sugar levels may be too high, and it is particularly relevant for individuals with diabetes. Collagen is a crucial protein responsible for wound healing. It helps in forming new blood vessels and tissues necessary for the repair of damaged skin. High blood sugar levels can affect the body's ability to produce collagen, hindering the formation of new tissue. White blood cells play a vital role in the immune response and the healing of wounds by fighting off infections. Elevated blood sugar levels can impair the function of white blood cells, making it harder for the body to combat infections at the wound site. High blood sugar levels can cause damage to blood vessels, impacting blood flow to the wound. Impaired blood flow makes it difficult for essential nutrients and oxygen to reach the wound slowing down the healing process the slow healing of cuts and wounds is linked to the overall impact of high blood sugar levels on the body's physiological processes increased blood sugar leads to glucose starvation of cells affecting their ability to function optimally including those involved in the healing process for people with diabetes the slow healing of cuts and wounds is a critical sign to monitor Diabetes is characterized by elevated and poorly controlled blood sugar levels, which can exacerbate the challenges associated with wound healing. Prompt intervention, such as adjusting medications, adopting a healthier lifestyle, and closely monitoring blood sugar can help prevent complications related to impaired wound healing. Number 5. Unexpected Weight Loss or Gain High blood sugar levels can influence body weight in unexpected ways, and changes in weight can be indicative of an underlying issue related to diabetes. When the body becomes resistant to insulin, a hormone that regulates glucose metabolism, it can result in weight gain. Insulin helps cells take up glucose for energy, but when resistance occurs, glucose is not efficiently utilized, leading to increased fat storage. On the contrary, in some cases, the body may respond to high blood sugar levels by producing excessive amounts of insulin. The surplus insulin prompts the body to convert glucose into energy, resulting in burning both fat and muscle tissue. This can lead to weight loss. High blood sugar levels can also influence appetite and cravings. Changes in eating habits, along with insulin-related effects, can contribute to weight loss. Unexpected weight changes serve as an alarming sign that blood sugar levels may be too high. Monitoring weight as part of diabetes management is crucial for preventing complications. Recognizing these changes early can prompt people to seek medical attention and get diagnosed for diabetes. In conclusion, recognizing the signs of high blood sugar is your first step towards a healthier future. Take control of your well-being by understanding these signals and explore the proven methods shared. Remember, your comments are important. Whether you have personal experiences, questions, or suggestions for future topics, drop them in the comment section below. We love hearing from you. If you haven't already, consider subscribing.